Hi everyone, I uh, hope you're all well and safe. Just a quick video on um, obstructions and passing vehicles. When we approach a vehicle like the parked vehicle in front, on the approach of the vehicle, we need to check our mirrors before we move out. If we're moving out to the right, which mirrors would we check? We'll be checking our centre and right mirror as we move out. There's no need to signal because our road positioning will tell other road users where we're going. And a signal in this instance could be misleading. Somebody might think we're pulling into a driveway. There could be a junction up ahead. So the signal could actually be misleading. So on the approach, approximately two car lengths away from the white car, we want to check our centre mirror and our right mirror. If it's clear and safe, we move out. We want to be approximately one metre minimum away from the parked car, in this case the white car in front of us. When we move back in and pass the vehicle, we then check our centre and left mirror as we move back in. And the hazard that we're looking for there, cyclists, somebody stepping out from behind the car. If the car was the other way around, the car could be moving off. So there's the risks that's involved as we pass that car. If there's a few parked cars, we could just stay out until we're finished passing them. We then need to think about who's got right of way if there's a car coming the other direction. On this scenario, there's cars parked on both sides of the road, so nobody has right of way. If there was no cars on the other side of the road, who would have right of way? It would be the cars coming towards us because the hazard is on our side of the road. So we let those cars go past us, then we would proceed. Before we moved off, we'd be stopped two car lengths away. We'd check our centre mirror and our right mirror before we move off. So let's just run through that now. So as I move off, six point check. No need to signal to say I'm pulling away because there's nobody around. Right centre mirror, right mirror, two car lengths away, out I come. Centre mirror, left mirror as I move back in. I'm moving back in because there's a van coming towards us and he's already committed to move out. So again, two car lengths away from this one. Centre mirror, right mirror, out I go. Because it was clear and safe. As I pass one metre away, centre mirror, left mirror, moving back in and I know it's clear and safe. Same again, two car lengths away. I check those mirrors, centre and right. Centre and left as I'm moving back in, roundabout ahead. Centre and right again, right hand signal. Now on this little spot roundabout, coming back to my roundabout video that I did earlier, I don't need to signal to say I'm exiting that roundabout because it's too small. You can if you wish, but it's not needed. Coming down here, who has right away, me or the bus? Currently I do, because the bus is far enough away. So centre mirror, right mirror, out I go. The only reason I've got right away is because I can see I've got plenty of room to pull back in as I pass these cars. So I intend to pull back in just here, unless the bus is gonna let me through. But I'll pull back in here to let the bus go. Again, two car lengths away from the blue car. So as I move off, it would be centre mirror, right mirror to check around the parked car. Centre mirror, right mirror, clear and safe, off I go. Again, no signal, not needed. My road positioning was telling everybody where I was. Centre and left mirror as I move back over. Anybody spot the speed limit on this road? 20 mile an hour down here. Zebra crossing, clear and safe. Speed bumps coming down here as well. We're going to be cautious and try and get them in the centre of the car. Looking at the crossroads crossing over our road ahead, we can see it's clear to the left and right. And again, some more hazards up ahead. So I need to move around those vehicles again. So for the final time, I would check on the approach, my centre mirror and my right mirror, and approximately two car lengths away, ready to move out. Keeping approximately minimum of one metre from the car. So here we go. Centre mirror, right mirror, Nice and clear and safe, out I go. Keeping approximately minimum of one metre from those cars. Following the road ahead. Didn't move back in because I could see it was nice, clear and safe. 
little bit of brakes for the speed bump, centre mirror, left mirror, as I move back to the left. End of the road, I'm turning left, centre mirror, left mirror, left hand signal, and I'm gonna follow that curb line round to the left, coming to a stop at the giveaway lines. Clear and safe, off I go. Still a 20 mile an hour road along here. So there we go, that's passing obstructions uh, on our left hand side. Moving past vehicles safely and clearing obstructions. Any questions, please comment. Don't forget, like, share and subscribe to this channel and these videos. If you have got any questions, please get in touch or comment on the video. Hope you're all safe and well. Take care.